All rise. Circuit Court of the County of Wayne is now in session with the Honorable Robert J. Colombo Jr. presiding. Please be seated. A Wayne County judge on Tuesday morning ordered the release of a key document that prompted Detroit Mayor Kwame Kilpatrick's secret $8.4 million settlement agreement last fall after a police whistleblower trial. City Council lawyer Bill Goodman recovered the previously missing document after hiring a forensic expert to retrieve it from Stefani's computer. Lawyers for Kilpatrick argued that the document should not be produced. But Judge Colombo agreed with Detroit Free Press lawyers that it was the public's right to see it. It's the very reason why the Brown case was settled. And in my judgment, that makes it a public document under the Freedom of Information Act. And I've already so ruled. You can hand out the copies. The 18-page document contains extensive excerpts of damaging texts between the mayor and his then Chief of Staff, Christine Beatty. In addition to having sexually graphic conversations, the two wrote about the firing of then Deputy Police Chief Gary Brown and the motives of Councilwoman Sheila Cockrell insulting her along the way. Responding to the document, Sheila Cockrell said that she was unfazed by Kilpatrick's insult and that she found most troubling the text messages that suggested Kilpatrick interfered in police department affairs to protect himself. After the judge released the document in Tuesday's hearing, Kilpatrick's lawyer, Jim Thomas, left without comment. Christine Beatty's lawyer had this to say. I've read them. I think that uh, they are, whatever they are, they're private and uh, have nothing to do with anything except sensationalism. Uh, if the media and, the, and everybody wants to create more than it is and keep on going with it, so, so be it. For the Detroit Free Press, I'm Jim Schaefer.